Welcome, welcome back to Dining Help at C Square. In this example, we have two similar figures, and we know the surface area of these two. The surface area of the small figure, which I'm going to call it SA sub S, is 192 square inches, and the surface area of the larger figure is it is 1,728 square inches. We also know the volume of the larger figure. And that will be 4,800 cubic inches. The question is, can we find the volume of the smaller figure? For that reason, I'm going to use the rules you see down here. And I'm going to start with this second one, which is set ratio of the area, which we call R square. And for that reason, we're going to, I'm going to do the quotient of the surface area of the larger figure over the surface area of the smaller figure. And you can do the other way, the small over large. I think it's better to do it large over small if you have that choice. And we end up with this quotient, 1728 over 192. I'll suggest you, first of all, if it's possible to grab a calculator and do this division. If it's not, simplify. Either way, you're going to have to get, in this case, 9 over 1. So R squared is 9 over 1. For finding R, I'm going to take square root of 9 over 1. And I will suggest you to keep it as a fraction, especially if it, the denominator is not 1. And in this case, we get 3 over 1. This is the scale factor for these two similar figures. But we don't need the scale factor for those, these two similar figures. We need the ratio of the volumes, which is it is nothing else than R cube. And you notice here how the R cube looks like. I'm going to have 3 to the third power over 1 to the third power. Raise to the third power each part of the fraction. And in this case, this will be 27 over 1. Once we have this ratio of the volume, we can move and find the volume of the smaller figure because this R cube is also the quotient, the ratio of the volume of the larger figure over the volume of the smaller figure. So we have here 27 over 1, which is R cube, equal. The volume of the larger figure is 4,800 over the volume of the smaller figure. And for finding the volume of the smaller figure, we can cross multiply, and we have 27 times the volume of the smaller figure equals 1 times 4,800. And then we're going to divide by 27. And we have the volume of the smaller figure is 1 times 4,800 is 4,800 over 27 and this one can be simplified by 3 4800 divided by 3 is 1600 and 27 divided by 3 is 9 so the volume of the smaller figure is 1600 over 9 cubic inches and that's it if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to click the like button and come back on c square for more help thank you